Hello everyone, in this video we have solved a nice math problem which is x to the power 9 plus x to the power 8 plus x to the power 7 over x to the power 10 plus x to the power 8 plus x to the power 6 is equal to 25 over 75. We'll find out what is the value of x in this math problem. How to solve this interesting math problem. So let's start here x to the power 7. So I take here is x to the power 7 plus 2 because of that here is 9. So here is small exponent is 7. So I can easily this x to the power 9, it will be x to the power 7 plus 2 plus and this x to the power 8, it will be x to the power 7 plus 2, 1. 7 plus 1, it will be 8. And here x to the power 7 over and here is small exponent it will be 6 so i can see really here x to the power 6 plus 4 it will be 10 plus x to the power 8 8 it will be 6 plus 2 and here is x to the power 6 is equal to 1 over 3 here is 1 third 75 divide 25 it will be 1 over 3 now according to exponential law we know that a to the power n plus m it will be a to the power n times a to the power m according to this law i can see this expression here x to the power 7 times x to the power 2 plus x to the power 7 times x to the power 1 plus x to the power 7 over and here x to the power 6 times x to the power 4 plus x to the power 6 times x to the power 2 plus x to the power 6 is equal to 1 over 3. Now at this moment i can see really here is x to the power 7 is common so i take here is x to the power 7 is common so this case divide this it will be x to the power 2 plus this divide this it will be x and this divide this it will be 1 over and here you can see really here is x to the power 6 is common here is x to the power 6 this is x to the power 6 this is x to the power 6 so i take x to the power 6 is common so it will be x to the power 4 plus this divide this it will be x square plus this divide this it will be 1 is equal to 1 third now at this moment uh, if i divide this x to the power 7 by this x to the power 6 so i can say that it will be x times this divide this it will be x and here is x squared plus x plus 1 over and here it will be x to the power 4 plus x squared plus 1 is equal to 1 third i solve this question step by step now at this moment i can see it here x times x squared plus x plus 1 over and here is x to the power 4 plus x square plus 1 i add here is x square then again i subtract this x square because of that x square minus x square it will be 0 then here 1 over 3 now at this moment you can see really here x times x square plus x plus 1 over then here this plus this it will be 2x square so i can see that it will be x to the power 4 plus 2x square plus 1 minus x square i add this x square and this x square it will be 2x square and here is one third now at this moment i can see this expression uh, it will be x times x square plus x plus 1 and at this moment you can see it here is x square so uh, x to the power 4 it will be x square whole to the power 2 plus 2 times x square times 1 plus 1 square minus x square this x square 
2 times x squared will be 2x squared and 2 times 2 will be 4 is equal to 1 third. Now, at this moment, uh, I can see uh, here it will be x times x squared plus x plus 1 over and in this expression you can see that if you think this is a so know that a square plus 2ab plus v squared it will be a plus v whole square so here is a it will be x squared plus v it will be 1 and whole to the power 2 you know that a plus v whole square will be a square plus 2ab plus v square minus x squared is equal to 1 over 3. now at this moment I can say this is a, this is b. So know that a square minus v square it will be a plus b times a minus b. According to this formula, I can say this expression here: x times x square plus x plus one, and this maths it will be x square plus one plus x, and here x square plus 1 minus x is equal to 1 third now in this fraction i can see it here this this cancel out because of that both are same so here x over it will be x square minus x plus 1 is equal to 1 over 3 now if i this times this it will be 3x this times this it will be x square minus x plus 1 and 3x 3 times x it will be 3x now at this moment you can see here x square minus x plus 1 and if i move on this bill in this side it will be 3x is equal to 0 now here x square minus 4x and plus 1 is equal to zero so we'll find out here is a nice quadratic equation it will be x squared minus 4x plus 1 is equal to zero so how to solve this question so know that here is x it will be minus b plus minus square root v square minus 4 a c over a according to this formula i can see really here x it will be minus b minus minus 4 plus minus square root v square i mean minus 4 whole square minus 4 ac a is 1 c is 1 over 2a a is 1 now here x it will be positive 4 minus minus it will be plus square root minus 4 whole square it is always here is even number exponent so it is always positive 16 minus 4 over 2 then you can see that it will be 4 plus minus square root 12 over 2 then here 4 plus minus square root 4 times 3 over 2 then i can see really here x it will be 4 plus minus square root 4 it will be 2 and here is square root 3 over 2 then this 4 divide 2 if i separate this fraction 4 over 2 and 2 square root 3 over 2 then here x it will be 4 divide 2 it will be 2 plus minus 2 to cancel here is square root 3 this is the value of x in this math problem thank you all if you enjoyed this video to subscribe my channel for other interesting video goodbye take care